Omga are known for their traditional vices and magnetic lifters, but now they've got another product in their range. Mark, what is it? Well, what they're launching at this Tim Tus uh, show, Colin, is uh, a range of modular uh, permanent magnetic vices. Uh, they come in um, four different sizes, um, basically different widths and different lengths. Okay. From, for example, from 75 mil wide up to 188, and in the lengths you can go from 213 mil uh, up to 344. Uh, millimeters long. Okay, but a magnetic vice is there are many on the market. What makes it so different? Well, I think it might be best just to showcase what it yeah, actually does. I can certainly show you. I mean, what we what we what we're showing here is for an ex exhibi exhibition piece. Really, we're, we're clamping a ring. Uh, it, it could be any profile, and what what we want to show is that we we have three fixed jaws that are giving the workpiece its datum here, here, and here. Now, I'm assuming those, those can obviously be moved around, though. They can, of course, yes. As you, you can imagine, that depending on the workpiece, you could have these modular vices, uh, modular vices placed strategically around the workpiece. But the actual data themselves, I mean, they can move? Yes, yeah. they, they can be moved around the, the workpiece itself. Uh, yes, you're right. And what you have as, as well as that, at the moment, then, we're, in, we're unclamped. Okay. We, put, we drop it down, and we know that the datum is set for the Z, for the Z axis. All of these other magnetic pieces are, are moving and are going to clamp the workpiece a bit without uh, distorting it. So it will follow a profile uh, of, of the workpiece. Okay, so that ring is flat, but it could actually have, I mean, it, it could, could be, be a profile. Yeah, it could be a profile, but we know where it is in the Z. Now we want to make sure that we've securely clamped it so that we can bring a machining head down to it and, and, and mill it, finish the bore or the, or the top face. So let's see, I mean, you might as well just turn it on basically. Yes, yeah, certainly. It's a simple turn of yeah. 180 degrees from one side to the other. And now that's absolutely rock solid. <laughs> and these that were moving earlier uh, are not, you know, have come okay. up and are helping to support the workpiece. Right, okay. Now you said there's, there's four models? Yeah, four models of different sizes. So we can, if necessary, pack a table. Yep or we can strategically place them around a workpiece. Where in the past you might have had a, a very long bodied vice to clamp a workpiece, with these, the, the economy of these is that you, you only buy as many as you need to support the workpiece. Okay. And now, of course you can add to it and take away. Okay. Now, what you buy this, what does it actually come with? Okay, well, when you buy a, a vice, uh, it, the accessories that it comes with are workpiece stops. So we'll have a workpiece stop at the end and at the side so that you've got your datum where you can load your workpiece up against a positive stop. Um, as well as that, you'll get some clamps, four clamps to clamp it down to your table and you'll get two uh, alignment keys that fit underneath that will align it into the t a slot on, on your table. Okay, it's so you've got that essentially that rigidity. Oh, to totally. It's, it's, it's absolutely rigid. It's against side and, and end forces, okay. yes. So ultimately giving you that, that repeatability. Yes, absolutely. Okay. But you've got a ring here. Can you fit other, you know, accessories? Well, can you get other accessories so you hold different profiles, different shapes? Yeah. If you imagine that uh, what I've shown you is clamping a ring, but for example, you can get uh, a V-shaped jaw, a, 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 a line of V-shaped jaws, uh, that you could put diameter work into, you could round bars in. So in the V, if you, if you have those V top jaws, you, you can hold a range of diameter bar uh, in them. As well as that, we have um, preset angles uh, of 30, 45, 60 and 90 degrees, so, so you can tip your workpiece uh, up accordingly. Okay, so ultimately you're getting total flexibility and you could machine a whole number of different profiles by using this system. Yes, that's right. You, that's absolutely right. So, and then really, I'm thinking rigid, flexible. Yeah, ri yeah. rigid, rigid, flexible, and economic. Excellent. Well, that's a great little summary and a great little way of showing us how it works. Thank you very much. Thank you, colleagues.